Let's Hello world. Hello welcome world. to the BJs. Welcome welcome to the BJs. The BJ <laughs> crew here to ah. share some wisdom from around the world or no wisdom, just share. We're here to share. We'll share, that's the word. You're building. I'm building the spear gun. <laughs> that's awesome. So did I send you the photo of the motorbike? No, you need to. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna share share this to you. Oh, look what's sticking out the back. What's sitting on top of the on top of it and sticks right out oh the back. Oh my god! All the I way. Thought, up it. I thought that were a railing. <laughs> <laughs> what the what the fuck's that? That's, that's gonna be that's gonna be the biggest piece of wood I've ever seen. And you drove, you drove that on your bike. Yes. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't kill somebody. So we, oh, wow. I've cut this. I don't know if you can see. Basically. So, wow. Basically what I've done is, well, that's the spear. There we go. Put that, put that somewhere safe where it can just, just balance. Did you make, did you make that spear? No, I bought the spear. Can we have a look at it? Oh, it's a bit hard to show you. So that's the back. Yeah, yeah. You see it? Yeah. Okay. Oh wow, it's massive. So that's the back, and this yeah. here, that little yeah. notch, that faces down. And that goes okay. into the trigger mechanism. So there's a part that clips up to here so that when it pulls, yeah. it hits that little notch. Okay. These things here are for yeah. when the string goes around yeah. attached to the rubber. This here is the tip. Yeah. And when it shoots... I can't do it right now because I would have to. Yeah, yeah, that's but all right. It goes through the fish and stops. This thing flicks out, and that's the stopper. Oh, I got you. Yeah. So the fish would be here, and it won't come off. Yeah, yeah. But back to you, and then you clip that down, and you can slide the fish off, and you're good to go. Yeah, yeah. Wow. And then it goes through here. This is the string. Yeah. Goes through here. So that you don't lose your, can you see the hole? Yeah, yeah, see, see the, the hole. So you don't lose your fish, uh, your spear, and the fish. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but that's awesome. What I had to do, I had to make a groove that fit this exactly, and was dead straight. That could also slide, let the spear slide, because if it has any little wiggles in it. It yeah. catches the spear and stops it from sliding. So I had to. Oh wow! I had to make a groove that goes all the way along this. That's awesome. So, so like right now, what I have to start doing is see how this part goes down more than this side. Yeah. This side I need to make equal to this, but yeah, this was an accident. This wasn't meant to go down that far. Yeah. But the wood split, so. Yeah, yeah. I have to work with what I got. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, that's all right. So basically what I'm going to do is cut this one down. I'm going to round the edges here um, so that this is like a nice little taper from a, from, yeah, so it tapers almost like to a really nice roundness there. Yeah, that's not going to be light then when you're carrying that. No, but it's underwater. Okay. So because this is almost to the weight of the water where it like yeah it can sink but if you're holding it it wouldn't really sink yeah yeah uh, nice and then i gotta cut off a ton off of here yeah yeah so like this is all gonna get rounded down here but before i do any of that i gotta drill the two holes ah fantastic so once i once i drill the two holes They'll go through there. Then I can start rounding off all of this. And that's where the rubber's going to go. There. And you got to pull. 
the rubber from there all the way up to here. All right, got you. Yeah, yeah. But I just realized something. Yeah. I'm not tall enough. Oh, I got you. Yeah, but... I can make the rubber go to here, though. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to say if you can make it to go to your reach. Which is just to here. Yeah. And then I, and then I just have to pull it to about here. Yeah. It's so funny. The other night when I was doing my work, my, my yeah. space, my, uh, my basically, you know when people go, okay, I'm going to have to stop working for a little bit so that I can clear my mind and do something else? Yeah. What I was doing was sitting up all night and going with this side to make the groove. I used, well, after I cut it, but to make it like flat and completely straight, I used this and you basically scrape it along there. Oh, wow. Along yeah, yeah. Groove. If you can't see it, I'll show you a video of it. Yeah, yeah. But basically you do that until it's nice and straight until it slides nice. it's funny though while i've been working on this i the more i've been realizing why no one ever makes things out of coconut wood why well have you seen how splintery it is oh yeah i saw that like it's strong like that's hard to snap but and that's like a tiny little piece yeah, yeah. But, like, look at that. Got you. And so it just it's just hard to work with. But once it's, once it's made and, like, nice and nice, I, I, it'll, I look, think it's it'll gonna, look wonderful and be beautiful. I think it's going to look great when it's done. Oh, God, I almost had, a, almost had a heart attack the other day. Why? So... I was screwing in. I'll, I'll grab it and show you one sec. Yeah, please. Um, all right, okay, Mark. I can see where, because you're going to put a pine season you know, a fish. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The fish, the fish goes in here. Yeah. The fish goes. And you still have that? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That goes there. That's all good. Um, yeah. But see this part here? Yeah. And where this string goes into? I don't yeah, know if yeah. you can see the metal bar, but there's a metal bar inside it. Yeah. Yeah. So that was by accident. Okay, got you. Um, because I was drilling in the the plate for the for the handle, so that's where the handle goes. Yeah, and got you. I made the pilot holes too small because I was like, oh yeah, let's make oh. pilot holes small. So then when I drill it uh, it really gets a good good hold on. Was okay, my thing, my thought process. But then when I when I went to drill, I drilled in these two and it was fine. I drilled in this one here, that little hole. Yeah. And yeah. it split the wood. Yeah, I can see. I can see that. All the way from here, all the way down to here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you see it? Yeah, I can see it. Right there, all the way down. And yeah. so I was like, yeah, yeah. what can I do to s prevent that happening anymore? And so yeah. what I decided was to drill a hole, a little hole in here. and Oh, I got you. And knock a piece of metal that's very, very tight fitting into the hole. Yeah. So that I can also hold, tie something onto here so that it can hold. So just in case. It's actually good. It's actually good. I needed to do that anyways, but I knocked it in so that it's tight. So when I was knocking it in, it actually pulled yeah. the wood together. So right now it Got pulled you. the wood together, and then I'm going to do a penetrating resin on the on the entire thing. Oh, and I put this on. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah. So that's, that's, that's great. That's the real. Yeah. So the real comes out here. Um, yeah, yeah, great. Yeah. But oh, it's, it's looking good up here. It's done. It's basically done. I just need the pen, penetrating resin, um, which I'll put a layer on literally everything after I've sanded the whole thing. 
I just need to clean up the top part. Like there's little yeah. in the railing here, all along the railing. There's um there's parts that can be kind of stabby. <laughs> no. Nice. For lack of a better word. Splinters comes off in splinters. Yeah, yeah. So I gotta, yeah. And then to finish off the last part, I am gonna put um right in here. I'm gonna put like a name or something. Yeah, yeah. Burn burn my name in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a great offer. Fantastic. Yeah. So it's back to this stage. Okay. Yeah. So basically that. Oh, I must have unplugged my thing. We got this in there oh. though. Oh yeah, nice offer. That's the fish. Yeah. Then you got your handle, and that part. Yeah. And where does the rubber go when you I'm, get the rubber? I'm missing one screw. Yeah. The rubber to pull it back goes there. Oh, it goes into there. Yeah, yeah. They both go through there. And then you pull it back all the way to here. I'm actually going to fix the fix the spear because it moves around a bit in here. Okay. And I don't like that. Um, yeah. I also wanted to I wanted to uh, make I wanted to make a safety, but um, yeah, because you said you got one on order, didn't you, Rose? Well, <laughs> I thought it was gonna work. It didn't. I just got a hole now through it. Oh, okay. Can you see it? Got yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that was meant for a thing. <sighs> didn't work. So, and then I had another idea that I could have done, but now I got the fish there. Uh. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Oh, well, you just have to be careful. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I'm, that's why I'm just... going to fix the spear. So that it's not moving at all when I put it in. So that it actually is safe. I need to find a way to put a safety in. Because at 200 kilos, at 200 pounds, 220 pounds of force... That can go through anyone, anything. <laughs> and Bloody hell. and my shafts only my shafts only six millimeters thick. Your shafts only six millimeters. Yeah, thick. which means it's going to have less resistance shooting in the water, so it will shoot faster. It's all. I just got to do bodybuilding to get it back. Yeah, Once yeah. I can get it back, I'll. Uh, Figure it out. Oh, I could just imagine you trying to pull it back, though, up there. That must be some powerful thing, though, up there. Oh, and it was funny. Money was like, I bet you can't pull both of them back. And I'm like, well, I can't pull one of them back. <laughs> really, I could, I could change one. something on the big one to make it go back by adding just longer string. Yeah. I could add longer string, but then... The string's too long. It's already too long. The string is this long, and really you want the string to be this yeah. long. Okay. So. I don't know really what you're talking about. The string that connects the rubbers. So the rubber, okay. the rubber goes through the through about. the holes and wraps around. Through the holes. And then there's, around. there's a part that connects the two ends together. And oh, that part okay. is. So when you pull it back, you want that you're pulling that rope oh, I got back you. to put it over the hook. <laughs> oh bloody hell! And so that. that's already this big. Just, that's already this big, and it should be it should be this big. So technically, when I say I'm that far off, I'm actually like that far off. Bloody hell! That's gonna be that's gonna be huge. I can't wait for it to actually yeah. see you oh, actually do I it. I know. I can't wait. So you imagine though, Ape, if you're doing that underwater, that means there's even more pressure because of the water pressure. You might have to do a lot more bodybuilding. What do you mean? Oh, no, no, there's the same. Because into underwater, there's more pressure around it. So then doesn't it get heavier? Yeah, but you don't pull it. 
you don't pull it back when you're at the top when you're at the bottom of the ocean. You don't hold your breath and go down there you and don't? pull it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just in case. That's <laughs> what you do is you pull it back and then you go down for the fish. So I have to figure out something. For we shot Mana's spear gun yesterday. You are joking. You shot the spear gun? Not the my one. The small one. Yeah, the yeah. The small one. Yeah. Nice. And it shot from, it shot from like, well, you don't really know how long that is. It's basically, it shot about a thousand square feet. Oh my God, that's awesome. Maybe, maybe a bit further. It's maybe 2,000. In the water? No. No, no, no. I, I had a feeling it would shoot pretty far, so I didn't shoot it in the water because it would hit the other side of the pool. Did you kill somebody? Well, technically no. A thousand, a thousand square feet is a long way. <laughs> That's the size of a house, of a big house. Did it go in a tree or something? Did you fire it in a tree or? No, I, I just fired it into the, like we've got the garden here. So I just fired it yeah. across the garden to see how far it could go. <laughs> That's awesome. And, uh, and to teach Mana, like, how to put the safety in and okay. to make sure the safety's on, never yeah, to yeah. face it towards anyone. Um, awesome. We're still working on that one. <laughs> he's just, he's just, just wanted to point it at everybody. Here come, oh, it was here hilarious. Comes, I'm here like, comes little Mana, Rambo. Just make sure you don't point it towards you, towards anyone. He's like, yeah, I'm not going to shoot it towards anyone. I'm like, that's, that's different. <laughs> just don't point it and then me and zion are walking up and i look up and the gun he's facing the gun backwards so that he's not facing it forwards and i'm like dude that's facing towards us not towards us so he turns past us and points it towards us again and i'm like oh my god what have i done <laughs> that's <laughs> awesome <laughs> little little rambo Running through, running oh. through the jungles. Here we go. <laughs> at least, at least it's got a safety. I'm gonna fix the safety so it it uh, doesn't move around as much. But uh, that's oh, amazing! Can... It's great, <laughs> and I I actually think it will. Sh I think it will easily kill a fish. Like, uh, oh yeah. Like a, if it can shoot a thousand in the out of the water, in the water because it's got no resistance. It's going to shoot about the same. Have you tried? Oh, no, you don't really want to try firing it into a tree, do you? I was going to say try firing it into a tree and see how far it goes in, but then it might go in too far and you can't get the bloody thing well, back it, out. It went into the grass, and I, yeah. and I had a really hard time getting it out. But in a tree, it's not going to go very far into the tree, I don't think. But, but if it does, you ain't getting his hat. Yeah, no, and it might bend it. So we could yeah, do... Yeah. We could do firing it towards, I think, like, getting a box would be a best idea. Yeah, yeah, a yeah, box yeah. box with, with, with something kind of hardish behind it. Yeah, like that's fantastic. Like a bottle or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To say, to up it, on his truth, to say, when you first started it, when I saw that big piece of wood, I thought, oh my God, how's he going to change that into a spear gun? And look at it. It's like a, an amazing piece of art. Well, that's that was funny. You and you and my brother think alike. And then he's he's looking at well, me. And he's like, "Oh, wow! What a great first attempt." Ah, oh, absolutely, it's fantastic. On okay. on that note, let's do an ending, Oppie. Yeah, let's do an ending. Well, Oppie, it's good to see you. It's good always to good you, to Oppie. chat with you. Oh yeah. So everybody, yeah. be safe out there. Exactly. And. And we are... We are the BJs. The BJs. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs>